All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I understand you want me to watch you do stuff. Okay, so I, I think part of the problem is because you're actively playing and like thinking about it. I just like, I think it help you a lot. I was trying to load the replay of my 1v1 with CCNC, but for some reason Valve did not save that replay. Damn. Uh, but I think it would help for you to just watch me play against like somebody. Yeah. So Cap's like six and a half K. He's not a bad player at all. I'm probably going to dumpster him here, but um, <laughs> it's still useful. It. Yeah, no, it sounds great. Okay. And also, thank you, Capitalist. Wop. Does he pick like... So... Appreciate you taking the time. And then I'm going to get into my very own game of doubter. Yeah. I just want to show you real fast so that... Hit auto buys. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's start this puppy. Cool. Uh, so I'm just gonna I'm gonna run it through for you, okay? Yeah. Like while I'm playing, so then you can see every step actively. And Mr. Capitalist will be Quap. All right, let us divine. Oh, okay. did I pick Puck? Okay, well, Puck's a bit complicated because Puck's like the direct counter to what we wanted to. Okay, <laughs> but it's fine. okay. It's well, fine. let's 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 just watch it play out though, because I you've spent enough time showing conceptually how pushing in yeah is very important, and I assume that still against Puck you do want to be pushing in in the same way that you were saying before. Yes. It's just more complex because Puck can do the same thing to me. But better. <laughs> okay, well that's actually super useful because I mean there's a lot of people who have been playing Shadow Fiend in mid, and I assume the Shadow Fiend has some similar qualities with his wave clear. It's the difference is that Puck can do it from an earlier stage, whereas SF does it from like level three and on. Yeah. You don't feel as bad playing against SF, whereas against Puck, he can match your aggression timings. He's like him and Tinker are I think two of like the few heroes that can do it. Well, this is great. Yeah. Hey, look, more people refer to it as a dragon penis. This is great. This is the new theme. We'll create a literal e peen for the players to measure against one another. Dude, my thing is huge. Dude, it is swole up. You can see, like, blue veins and everything. It's on <laughs> top. That's what happens when you get to level 2400. Farming skins all in. I have so many items. I just started, uh, we have this like chat with a bunch of Dota players and I just started dumping stuff on people. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right. Okay, so. Excellent. Uh, Excellent. Immediately... You did not know what you were doing. <laughs> so, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Okay, I won't block either, uh, just to make it fair. So I bring this off to myself. Yep. Um, I auto this first wave. You see, as it comes in almost immediately. Yep. Get the last hit. This is the problem with Puck, is that he can do shit like that, you know? Yep. I fucked up, but... Still, same concept, is there? Yeah, so I'm going to push in the wave now. Yeah, you didn't go for the deny. You tried to push the wave in. Yeah. So, you notice, like, he moved back slow, so I get a few pot shots off on him, and even then, like, I can bring one back, and then I'll drift the way back. So he's trying to, like, push the way back towards me. You notice, like, that's the meta, right, between yeah. us? It's, like, him pushing the wave, my, me pushing the wave. I'm autoing this creep. I'm going to CS it. I fuck up, but conceptually, like, it doesn't matter if you fuck up yeah. if you CS. You notice, like, he can do this, too. Yeah. And that's the annoying part with Puck. But, you know, this is the meta is that uh, I can push it back. When he's on my hill, I'll get a right click. I want to bring it to my tower to push out the wave artificially. Oh, I see. So when it's pushed in, like, you obviously don't want to just have loads of creeps underneath the tower taking yeah. massive damage running around every which way. But 
it's really nice to get just a few under there so you can push it back out again. Yeah. And then you notice, like, this time I push it into him and while he tries to see us. Yeah, I see. He's trying to get those last few hits, and that's when you're getting the right clicks. And now that the wave yeah. is here, you're not looking to get right clicks on him necessarily. And I'm sure that eventually I'll be good enough to make small, minor judgments. But in terms of broad strokes, just trying yeah. to get your own last hits. And now, and now he's going to push the wave. And you are not trying to go for that last hit too quickly no, because I'm you don't want to get a lot of pot shots yeah. on him. Or pot shots if, on you. If you can do it fast, then it's fine. If you can't do it fast, then it kind of sucks. So now I have a bottle and I haven't even had to expend myself because, you know, I'm not greedy. And now I feel good. You know, I'm gonna I'm gonna counter push out the wave, like really aggressively. Oh god. I didn't even listen to my own advice. So like now my wave is pushing in real aggressively, and you can pretty much do whatever you want from this position, right? So I get one or two right clicks, and then watch what I'm gonna do. Instead of like forcing things, I'm gonna try to like get denies and fuck with him, you know? And then I'll get hit once, but it's a good trade. Now I'll shove in the wave. And notice like how scared he is now. Like every I time I shoved in the wave. You're really not using your dragon slay very much at all. You don't have to, like it's I can, but it's not as big of a deal. Like I fucked up that two hit principle too. Creeps. But you notice how I can like follow in and like almost zone him? Yeah. Wow. You can use that creep rage, like that's what I mean by when you have one creep, you can use it kinda as like a buffer between you and him. Like, you can continue to chase in, because the tower won't hit you unless you right-click him, you know? So now I push in the wave, I'll leave that at 1. If he goes to the deny hit, then, you know... Oh, there's the 2-hitter, yeah, this is when you have level 2 on your Dragon Slave. Yeah. Wow, then that was clean I follow as hell. Up. Deny. <laughs> you see, like, it just, it just ruins him when you go for these, like, 1-hit denies and stuff. Like, he got 0 out of that creep wave. That's why pushing it under the tower is like so rough because it gives me options. Like I can do stuff like that. Now I can pretty much just like spam. Do you notice how I keep moving forward too like this? Like what's he yeah, gonna do? Holy shit. Then I can just like fuck with him here. And now this is where you'd go get the rune because you're so far pushed yeah, in. Exactly. But I also got like every single deny oh, CS. Fuck. Like he got one CS out of that. You see that this is like the meta that has developed between, even he understands it. And he's not a mid player, he's like, he pushes out the wave, I push out the wave. But he's just slower at it than I am. Because he doesn't play mid as much as I do, you know? Right. And then I follow oh. up through the wave. So how many last hits do you have right now? I have 31. God damn. Yeah. And he never gets that range creep, if you notice, because of this. Because when you push in the wave like this, I will tell you... Every single time you push in the wave like this, after the first creep that the tower is targeting, it'll always go for the range creep after that. So when you push in the wave like that, it's impossible for him to CS or whatever. Mm -hmm. Like Fuck. it's, I have 31 CS, he has like 17. It's, oh, it's like, it's, it's an impossible game for him at this point. Like even if I get ganked at this point, what does it matter? Like it doesn't change, it doesn't change the game, right? Yeah. Like one, one death I think would put him still like 200 net worth behind me or something like that. Two, three hundred net worth behind me, and that oh, feels yeah. great. So you, you see, like the difference between what you were doing and what I was doing is like, um, when the wave pushes back to you, <laughs> was <insert>. a lot. <laughs> <laughs> but when the wave pushes back to you, like pull it, then push it back out. It's like an ebb and a flow, right? I see. When the late, when you push him under the tower, inevitably, like. You know, at some point the wave will push back in um, into you. You know, you just you can be a little bit more patient. You can you can focus more on like messing up his CS rather than going for these like aggressive right clicks. Because I haven't had to right click him that much, right? Like, yeah, no, I mean you natural. have only done it when you have almost no creeps left and you're pushing. Exactly, and for the most part, like I haven't had to. I have full mana, full everything. I haven't had to full like full everything. Yeah. Like, I haven't had to expend too much. You notice, like, I use my Dragon Slaves, like, I time it right. If I can harass or get 2 CS. The only time you ever used them a lot was used twice in the first wave, and that's it. Yeah, because he was pushing the wave into me, right? Like, I have to counteract that. Yeah, fuck him. Stupid bird yeah. person. But he understands that concept. Like, he's not the best at it, because, you know, he's not a natural mid player, but for the most part, you know, he, he understands that like, he has to shove the wave back into me. 
Huh. Man. Damn. Okay. I think that conceptually it makes sense, and I will proceed to fuck it up for tens of games <laughs> until I have it under my belt. But I love that you've created like a go a very clear, here is the goal to get to. Yeah. Uh, so just realize, like, you, you remember how I see us, right? Like, I, yeah. I push myself forward. It doesn't, it doesn't really matter. I didn't even have to use myself because he doesn't really, when you're pushing the lane like that, he doesn't have an opportunity to fight you back. Mm -hmm. That's the cool thing about shoving the wave is like he, he won't find opportunities to fight you back ever. Like you're going to be in his face at all times. Yeah. Like, I mean, notice I just he had to go through on, all his regen. Yeah. He has no regen and no mana and you have full mana, full regen and extra salve yeah. and boots. He also I said that he didn't buy items, but yeah. I feel amazing watching you feel amazing. Danka. All right. So, I believe it's time. All right. If you, want, if you want to stay, if you want to stay tuned in on this shit, we yeah, can just go, I'll let dude. You play. Yeah, go. All right. Well, hell yeah, we're gonna stay on this screen until it's time to go. And um, yeah, I don't know. It's it's always interesting to me. I, I feel like there's two Sean's anytime I'm playing games. There's the Sean who's playing the game, and then there's the part of me that's like observing me play and trying to take notes. And it's I remember this would always happen in StarCraft where um, you know, because when you play like Brood War especially it is just a continuous sequence of extremely accurate mouse clicks that just have to all nail it. Like, you know, if you're walking back to lane in Dota, you, you can click vaguely in the middle of the lane and your character will go there. But there's just a lot of, like, click exactly on the barracks, hit the button, click exactly to this location on the screen so you can select the SCV so you can click him to there and then click exactly to this location. And there's times when I've either not played a race for a while or stopped playing for a while and when I come back it takes like an extra quarter of a second here and there just like an extra quarter second to just click accurately and to move this thing there just an extra quarter second and all of a sudden I'm like unable to scout anymore and it's so weird to have that feeling where it literally doesn't feel like I have any time to just control an SCV moving around and it's been really cool seeing like oh for fuck's sake we have three people who've selected mid. Um, <laughs> um, just, just say please. Uh, Maybe it'll work. May I please play mid this game? Mr. Moose in. I'm actually really surprised that you got it as much as you did. Yeah. Alright, select that mid. That'd be okay. I mean, he's I mean, got... He's got Shadow Fiend selected. I don't want to ruin his life, though. Um, I should probably just go. Oh, he said sure! That's amazing. Wow. Hey, speaking of Brood War, can I ask you a really specific question regarding Brood War? Oh my god, nothing would make me happier. Okay, so do you remember that strategy series you did on Fantasy versus GG Play, the best of five? When Fantasy went that Vulture drop in a Valkyrie build? Yes. I think GG Play was on CJ Antis. And speaking of, because I'm coaching you right now, do you think that the coaching team at CJ learned to counter that build specifically because next time you use that build in Pro League against CJ player, I think it was effort. He got Zergling all in at the perfect timing. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I think that the, that style is... It came and went almost immediately. Uh, I'm just picking here. I don't give a fuck. Uh, so the style... You guys not counterable anyways. You're fine. Yeah, she's invincible. Yeah, that style came and went almost immediately because it kind of revolves around getting a lot of things that are not actually good in a long-term sense right at the time when you would not expect them because you rush for Vulture Drop with speed, which gives you essentially no strong answers. It's not like you have four or five Vultures so you can plant some mines down to deal with some all-ins and kind of help with stuff that way. Um, and then you just go into this style that is precisely good against someone who's going for fast mutalisks, like two hatch mutalisks. And M Medusa was a commonly played map at the time, and I remember seeing that, like, you have all these angles on Medusa that are really strong with vultures uh, to drop, and Zerg doesn't have a really easily accessible third, so it was really common to do on that map. But, you know, when you start playing on a map like Fighting Spirit or more modern maps where there's less harass angles to your main base and you have safer second bases, 
I mean, you literally just can scout it easily and build two sunken colonies for defense. You can Zergling all in. You can three hatch Muta and just win almost automatically. Um, if you if you have never seen it before, you'll lose probably 100% of the time. But once you've seen it, you can actually take huge hits to your drone count and your build order. And there's just nothing proactive that the Terran can do to follow up. Because the Terran has to go for Valkyrie Goliath just to make sure that they don't die to Mutalisks. And uh, so I saw a number of ways that um, teams responded to it. Honestly, just waiting for the map rotation was helpful a lot, but effort... I don't, I, I don't remember the specific effort game, but that would not surprise me, because, you know, fantasy always loves his cutesy builds. So there's my, there's my spiel against it. I, I, I think that the more accurate thing was that I have no fucking clue how coaching staff works in any eSport. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, that is a like, complete knowledge gap. I, I know some about the, you know, team side of, like, running a team as a business and, like, yeah. you know, how cash flow and money works and, you know, where some of the opportunities lie. I have some knowledge there, but I don't, I don't know. Abs I fucking know nothing about managing a team about coaching a team so so i'll give you a confident possibly possibly you know who asked me that i i gotta complain that wasn't actually my question it was uh hot bits oh that makes sense he was like he said he really wanted to know the answer to that hot bit is just legit the best man he is so good by the way hey do you want do we want this screen do we want this screen or do we want this screen I think maybe this one. I think this one. I think one. either's fine. One or two. Oh shit, it's the glasses one thing, huh? Or two. Three? Three? <laughs> or four? Three? Alright. I think I think we wanna wanna keep you on this. Can I steal two tangos, please, from someone? Oh shit, you even announced it! Oh you lost! No, I got this shit. You're not supposed to announce it though. Jar of Coppers, any chance I could steal a second one or Phoenix? I'd love to have two tangos for mid. Oh, you're very sweet, thank you. Sean, there's a new meta about not caring about MMR and Dota. You're supposed to not care about MMR and Dota. Yeah, God, let me tell you. Like, no, there, there's... For me, it's when I feel good or bad about my play. Like, the MMR is fine. However it winds you have up being, to, oh, I going? You have to quickly... You have to quickly all chat, I don't care MMR. Otherwise, they're gonna try hard. No, see the thing is that doing anything external to these to these nine fuck men I'm playing with doesn't matter. Doesn't yeah. matter. What's gonna happen? Holy what are shit, they gonna their, do? Their lineup is so much better than yours, and you have a jungle. You have another jungler again. I don't know why this keeps happening to you. This is this is why it is. Guys, I'd like to wish you a warm good luck and uh, have fun. So probably up against Venomancer in mid or Marana in mid. Um. No, I think what's going to happen is you're going to be against a Veno mid, and that Marana is just going to roam on you nonstop, dude. Oh. Have you ever eaten cheesecake? Because I'm cheesecake. I think I, I think I've thrown him off the scent. You got him. <sighs> Why is there just a jungler in all your games? Why is that happening? I I I have it in probably sixty percent of my games when I'm off stream. What? <laughs> yeah, almost every single game. I, it's actually I would say it's rare for me not to have a. Jungler, so I, I, I'm going to stop talking for a moment now because I really need to focus. Just play. I don't really need to focus, but I'm going to really choose to focus. I can't explain it. Easy CS. Oh. Burn them all. <laughs> so I think that should I not be denying like this? No, it's fine. I mean, he he pushed the wave in. I would eat the tango though. Thank you. But you do want to uh, start pushing the way back into him. I think I messed that up. No, it's fine. I think I didn't. He's running low on mana. I don't know what this guy's play is, but... You're gonna push the way back in and he just used arrow twice for CS. I fucked up. No, I didn't. No, it's I'm fine. Best. So I want to hit this, and then I yeah. hit it again. 
I accidentally hit stop. He's being really annoying. Hit him once because I hate him. Oh, come on. Sal. That was enough. Thank you. Remember, now we're now we're in our money zone. So I want to hit this once, hit it twice, whiffed it. It's okay. Okay, so here's the one that I want to attack. God damn. Alright, so there's a d double damage rune up there. In general, uh, I think I would have nuked that wave so that he yeah. can't go for that DD. And then you just back up. Don't let him get too many hits on you. Should I just use my second um, tango yeah. on a tree? Just a regular tree. Alright. So I'm going to try to even this up a little bit. Yeah. Perfect. He's going to get that deny, but that's life. Fire away. Yeah. Is a DD rune. Can't do much about that. I would eat a tree right now if I were you. Thank you. Thank you very much. You see though, like even when he has a DD, this is what's that. This is what was supposed to happen in the Tinker yes. game. Is if the yeah. wave is pushing into him, he can't do anything about it anyways. So there's a bane down there. Fucking how long does this bullshit last? I mean, I know it's done right now, but come the fuck on. What the fuck just happened? Oh fuck. It's okay. I believe in you. Pop your bottle charges. I think if you hadn't accidentally nuked, you would have killed him actually. I actually deliberately nuked. <laughs> I, I deliberately. I mean, that, was, that was some timing then by him. That was godlike. I think he's out of mana now though, and HP. So he's pretty like. You can just shove him out of the wave now with nukes and stuff. I think I'm just. You can be. Right yeah, perfect. Hit it. And then just. You can chase up, remember? You don't have to be so afraid. Yeah, no, it's 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 hard. It's hard to break this fear. Now you back. Get arrowed. I would actually sit up here for the room. I would go further back because he's gonna go for it. I think you just go back to base. Okay. It's fine. Yeah. Just grab a grab a TP and in this game it's kind of specific, but I would get raindrops. I wouldn't right do now. it all the time, but yeah, I'll just buy them. Interesting. Okay, so that entire s okay, so let's see. I'm 17 at four minutes, which means I'm gonna I'm I'm on pace for like 50 ish. This player seems much better than most people I'm ever up against in mid. He seems very yeah. aggressive at whacking me. I mean, the biggest thing that you notice is like that was kind of cool by him is he would um he would arrow the the range creep, so he would yeah. shove your wave. So he was counteracting your shove, you know. That was pretty cool. You don't see uh, people do that very often. But you got all the CS. You're fine. Like, I'm going. CS God damn, fine. because I pushed so far forward, I actually even had the opportunity to. Yeah. Light him up. The only downside, I guess, was I think three times in a row you've gotten oh. DD'd. Oh. Okay. It's okay. Fuck, I was at 396 uh, on my boots. Should I even buy a town portal? Should I just sell no, this? No, I would just sell it. Uh, so a trick to get out of base faster is just like, nuke the ground. Oh yeah, yeah. And just get out of there. Can we get a flying courier by any chance? Yes. Whenever you get a That's why, uh, right? you know, if you, if the wave is pushed there, like you don't care. You don't really care that yeah. much that you die, because it doesn't change things too much at all. You guys just have kind of weird lanes because you have a jungle bloodseeker, so they can get away with ganking you like that. One time. So, oh, I need to be attacking this. That's right. No, see, normally I just fucking chill for a few seconds. Nah, never chill. Yeah. See, like there, that was instinct, just kicking in. So what I should be doing is, doing this. I should hit this back guy once, and then I should do this. 
Oh, this is really bad. I have no idea who to attack, so I'm just doing this. <laughs> I, I literally, I was just like, uh... It's alright. See? Now you got like... Six? Seven? Yes. Seven hits in a row on him? That's pretty good. Oh, shit. Well, that is three people in your lane. I got very disoriented. Oh, fuck. Yeah, see, this right here is why I rarely, if ever, push my wave in that hard. Nah, I don't care about that. Yeah, so, like, typically, I died here, but I should just say to myself, this is okay. Typically, is right? I mean, the biggest issue is that you have a jungle bloodseeker. So they're allowed to get away with this. Like, normally, alright, here's what happens in my games, right? If they do shit like this, like, my other two lanes are, like, stomping. But... Because <laughs> you got a jungle bloodseeker, it, it's kind of okay for them. But it's still fine. I would just push out waves more aggressively in general. Oh, fuck. oh god. See, like, you're not even pushing out the wave, you're just getting dove by three people. Like, it doesn't matter, right? Oof. That death feels the worst out of all of that, them. That was the worst feeling death. Everyone left. Yeah, it's like, they just dove you under a tower. You can't do a lot about that. Well, couldn't I have just, like, TP'd more conservatively? Because I TP'd into a way too aggressive spot, I think. Uh, I mean, fundamentally, the biggest issue is that they were just faster than you. It's okay. I think this game is still... I think this game is still fairly easily winnable. I mean, I like, like, me as... Oh, they have Drow, that's right. So they're yeah. doing all sorts of extra damage. Okay, so. Yeah, at least that guy's there. Alright, there's three people again. That's hype. God, they right click you for so much. Yeah, I'm. I'm hurting, man. That's I not... probably shouldn't have thrown down that Q there. Okay with it. How much damage? Oh, he does have raindrops. Okay. He has like plus 180 right now in right clicks. Holy shit, that's intense. Holy fucking shit, dude. Oh my god, that is a lot of damage. Yeah, I think you had 110 health there, and he right-clicked you once and you died. Holy fuck, man. I think that Dro's like level 7 right now. God, this game is so brutal. Why do people have to pick junglers? See, okay, because this happens so much, this is why I always play really conservatively. And just nah, like stay matter. back and get my farm up. It shouldn't? Okay. No. I would still, I would tell you, if I was in this game, well, I think one of your deaths was avoidable, but I would be like one in three right now. But I would have more farm than you. <laughs> and then, then it truly doesn't matter. Oops. Okay. Yes. Oops, I don't need to hit that one. Just, so, just. just shove the wave real fast. And then, uh, and then now you Oops. can back up. Go jungle. Oh my god, your team's just dying everywhere. This is so rough. Okay. I think your Bloodseeker used your shrine too, that's epic. Yes, he did. I think I'd want my... So, item-wise, I really like getting the, uh... Marana's above. So Marana is, or um, I want to go for Bloodstone, and so I'm getting the, I can't remember the name of it, Soul Ring first. Jesus Christ, he did, she deals so much. I'm okay. Gucci. Yeah. So is this, is this too risky to do stuff like this if I just am trying to get some last hits? Nah, she already used Leap. What's the cooldown on Leap? Now I would back. I think I have to back all the way. Well, should yeah. I get a top shrine? You think that's the right play? No, I would go back entirely. Remember uh, what I said about like being topped off versus like... Yeah. It, it doesn't feel good, like, because what's going to end up happening is she's going to right click you twice and you're going to nuke once and you're going to have to go back anyways. So this way you just save yourself like 45 seconds. Walking. 
Yeah. But like 45 future seconds. Yeah. So should I be going elsewhere? Should I like go to bot lane and push that out, or should I just keep coming back mid? So many your towers. One time? Got him. The comeback. Got him. One time! Uh, yeah. So the crazy part, like, is now you should only be, like, a K behind or something. I'm thinking about this right. Rising. They have so many towers, though, dude. Yeah. And you don't have any towers. I would be... A little bit weary here. I would just. I think the rune is. Did they grab the rune already? What the hell? Yeah, I don't see it anywhere. So. I think it's top. It might. He might it's just. Top, just just out of range or something. Yeah, that's what I think is going on here. He first. Unless they were there like right when they spawned. Uh, so I would send courier after to the secret shop. Yeah, I, I I sent it to the secret shop a moment ago, but someone snagged yeah. it. I love your dudes. Your middle tower is under attack. Oh yeah. Uh so, just go back to base. Really? Yeah. Just to stay go. topped off? Yeah. Alright. Yeah, that's th this is that, that's a behavior that I like literally never do. Oh whoops, sorry, I accidentally sent myself as well. Like oftentimes a lot of people will go back just to like or will stay just to stay, but there were three people mid. <sighs> If you go back there, you most likely die. And going anywhere else on the map right now seems really improving. Really poor idea. Yeah. I think now you shove out mid again. Yeah, this game is. Yeah, I think you just keep shoving out mid once in a while, and then you just go. You alternate between the jungle. You don't have to like rush anything right now. The game is fine. See, right now at this point, I would I feel like I am incredibly far behind of where no, I would. It's not a big deal. I'm really bad. <laughs> Sorry. Really bad. I'm really bad. I'm really bad. To battle. Oh, she went down. Let's get that thirst. I'm just gonna do this to hope that yeah. Oh. See, now you got her. I don't think All you're right. that far behind. I think you're like you're behind because you guys are like. O to four and towers or some shit like that, but the game is fine. I absolutely promise you, Sean. Thank you. Now you bet. So I just went for the um, damage talent. Normally I get the range talent, but if uh, I'm feeling behind, that. I like the damage in order to. Push out top. Yep, sorry, my getting cat haired. I don't know what the heck's happened. Like, so my cats like to sleep on my mouse pad, and it, it is rarely, if ever, a problem. We are okay. Okay, no. so you want to be... Going back to base? You want to be going back to base and then you just push up. Click the Mirana on your way back. What she have? You tied in items and she has three towers to your zero. Like, huh. I don't, I don't feel behind at all. Wow. What, you're level 10? What's the highest level on their team? 10. 12, excuse like, me. See? Well, I mean, you can't really do anything about that. She just got a quad kill. But before, before that, you guys were tied as holes. <laughs> it's okay. We've doubled down. I oh. believe in the power of us. Uh, in this case, you never want to go bottom. So, I mean, look, my thought process is it's the most pushed out. Therefore, I will have the safest time jungling here. It's also the most invaded. It's because you didn't watch my second video. That's right. But at the same time, like, this farm doesn't do anything for you, conceptually. Because you're immediately just going to have to leave it anyways. The easier way would have been if you went top down. Alright, now let's do OP shit with Lena. Uh, just keep moving yourself up, essentially, during this time. Like, fuck, fuck going bottom. Fuck all that stuff. Your job right now is, like farm that top side area you're gonna push that wave out aggressively they're all bottom you don't even have to i, I promise you like i'm gonna map hack for you here no, like, well, they're always I, gonna be bottom 
I feel much more... I don't know, like... Well, I felt focused, honestly, in my first game, but for whatever reason, it yeah. didn't go so good, but, uh... You push out one more wave here, and then you jungle the two camps. Like a wildfire. But, like, I am able to process my minimap. Are you sure you don't hit this, like this? Nah, back. Okay. You see, like, somebody will always come almost instantly. It's not worth it, usually. <laughs> you keep saying people will always come? Almost instantly, and I'm like, I've just, I've never seen this kind of behavior in my life. I... Okay, so chill for like two seconds, just chill. And you're gonna see what he does. You're gonna kill this camp, and he's gonna push the way back into you, and you're just gonna wait for it to come into you. Uh, so do I have going... regen now? Oh, go back. Back up. Go back to like where your tower used to be, essentially. Uh, you can save your regen for a bit longer. You can save your regen for another nuke set. Okay, now you back. Uh, and see, like, it forces play. Now look what you've done for your team. Yeah, this is you've is... allowed... You've Sorry, allowed man. your team to clear out their own jungle. As a result of you playing like this. This is That's what why Kevin... it's better to go top. Yeah. This is what Kevin was like, constantly... Repeating me over and over again, is do just push waves. Just push waves. Just yeah. fucking push the waves, Sean. And I do until I begin to feel Back. upset and afraid. Wait, really? Yeah. Holy shit. Thank you. Dude, talking and looking at mini-maps at the same time is impossible. I don't, know if I, I don't know if it's ever been done before. I think I should let this fall and go to mid and try to knock that shit down. What's going on with your homies? Back up and push out top. See, I keep feeling like I can just go up and kill that guy. A scary proposition right now. It's hard for you guys to kill anybody because uh, you have zero stuns. <laughs> and. Woohoo! I found That's that not my... true. You have Ice Path. That's kind of something. 19 minute Bloodstone, yay. It's fine. I don't know why I'm staying in range of these guys. Well, I do. I wanted to get some coffee. Feels good. Considering you died, you went 2 and 4, I still think you're the highest, if not like the second highest net worth. That would not surprise me. So I'm going to. Well, I don't have a TP scroll, which sucks. So, everyone is like mid and top, so I'm just going to push us in one more time and see what we can do up here. I just really wish I had a TP scroll. But, I didn't buy one! Hmm? You don't necessarily have to be doing something like at all times. You never feel as if like you're pressured to do something at all times. It's more like, um, you can be patient, like you can let the wave come back into you and stuff, you know? This is you don't necessarily so just like hard to, Yeah. That is an unbelievably hard thing to train out of me, because I just... Oops. I I think I used this right. Fuck it. Yes. Doing it. You know uh, in StarCraft uh, you it's wanted... like always oh, be doing stuff. Always be like going somewhere, doing something aggressively, so on and so forth. But you know, so in this Not game it's patient. it's still super jammed into my head. So that Mirana right. is three towers ahead of you, by the way, and you're like three hundred gold behind her. Really? Yeah. So you know like that feeling where you're just like, I'm behind, you weren't, you shoved out the wave, she didn't, she has like 10 kills, you have two, you use 300 net worth behind her, and that's like mainly tower gold. Oh. That's the cool part about dotes. I am in a reasonably safe location. You have 100 CS to her 78 right now. Yes. Like, at 18 minutes of the game. Like, game's perfectly I'm fine. Bloodstone suicide? Did I get it off? No, didn't. Man, not having stuns is really hard. <laughs> Dude, I really like the thing. You guys can't thing. cancel this. There we go. You guys are gonna stomp this fight, actually. I think you take mid tower with this fight. Let's take mid tower. Bloodseeker's pushing top. Do 
We're gonna get some hits in on it though. Flee. It's done. I have Moonlight Shadow, we have so much attraction. Oh, I was 100% convinced I was out of the way of that. I'm so bad. Well, at least you're I still got a really... Yeah, now, Blood Seeker's gonna get in there and no, he's, continue he's to hit neutral. <laughs> There's like 200 HP heroes. Yo, I'm a jungle only I can't handle seeker. this. He just said, I'm a jungle only blood seeker in chat. <laughs> you melted! Oh, I'm dying right now. What's going on? See, for me, th this is this is like pretty typical. I What did I just TP to? Whoops. Your team's so sad. This this is this is pretty typical for my games, and this is why I like feel that this is the, the reason I feel bad is not because of anything my team's doing, but because of like the fact that I'm two and six. No, that's fine. It's like a product of the game. Asshole. Okay, he's gonna rupture him, and that guy's dying. Oh, I f I feel the rupture. It's coming. Uh -oh. oh, he's so gonna die. There we go. Damn it, I didn't get the kill. It's okay. I wanted, you're like, I wanted the kill steal. Alright, so I'm just gonna push bottom in. Yes. Go. Oops. I think I. I think I did not make good use of this plus 80 light striker rate damage. I think I really needed to get the range this game. Nah, no, that's fine. Oops. I would get, uh, most of the time, by the way, I'd get phase boots for anything. I've been seeing a lot of people get that, but... It's so broken. Oh. Is this safe for me to be doing this? Oops. No, I'm back now. Nice. Easy. Be aggressive. The enemy's bottom tower has fallen. Are you the Six. highest level in the game yet? Sixteen. I am the second highest. Bloodseeker is seventeen. I mean, that guy's done nothing but hit neutral, so I'd consider that a win. See, like this sort of split push around is the bulk of my pub games that I win at least. It's just like push you here. would not have to do this if you had five heroes that could fight their five heroes. Oh hey Bane. Nice. He's saying something to me, I can't even hear what he's saying. So, right now what I'm doing is I'm just looking for some sort of kill on this bane. Specifically after I get my Shadow Blade. Yeah, you don't have to force any plays right now. Like, plays will happen. They'll develop. This guy is just saying all sorts of stuff and I just cannot understand it. Okay, so here is where... Maybe this is too aggressive of me, but I like do this a lot. Just like march into here. See if I can see someone. Push out top? Yeah, and then when I don't see anyone, then I come back and do this. I call that the purge special. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah? Did Kevin teach you that one? Yeah, he did. He did, and today you get to be that, Kevin. <laughs> okay. Okay, so I don't have a TP, which makes me feel red cheeked, but you know what? Fuck it. Bye. 
Get the tower. Oh no, dude, I did not. I'm so embarrassed. I am ashamed right now. You need to get back. I don't have TP, man. Isn't that sad? I don't think your Bloodseeker does either, is the problem. Nobody's defending. It's okay, we got your Tiro. Man, you are really committed to not going back. Dude, I'm, I'm walking back as hard as I can. I saw you go for those neutrals. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, yeah. Yeah, no, this is this is exactly what pains Kevin as well. You know what, I'm gonna go for these ones too. Isn't that sad? Isn't that sad? It's okay. Now, See, now I have the TP boots, which means now I can be a functioning, interesting member of society now. Let's do it, guys. It's okay, I'll consider that one a lost cause. I don't consider a lost cause, you know, just it's a learning experience for everyone involved. Alright, now what do I want my next item to be? You don't need that, Rex. Is what I meant. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's good, because the wave will push into me, and we all know that if the wave's pushed in, you get safe farm. Yes. What is my next item? Let me think. Don't don't say what you would do. I want to I want to think and process and analyze. Okay. Here. Oh hey, what do you know? You're above that Marana and not worth in this game. Sick, so sick. Hey, it's tied for highest level in game. Um, I, I kind of. Oh, let me. Bye. Got one. I kind of. I'm thinking BKB, honestly. Okay. But I don't know if that's too early. I'd get Shivas. That was the closest fucking call of my entire life. Can you explain the Shivas pick? Uh, so, if I look at their lineup, it's like, um, especially with the draw and stuff, I think it's a lot of physical damage. Oh, I think if you get a BKB, I think if you get a BKB, you're just gonna get Fiend's Grip. Oh fuck, Fiend's Grip. I keep forgetting that shit. Well, oh. rip. Suicide. Ah oh, fuck. Totally forgot suicide. 100%. 100% forgot it. It's okay. So, level 20, so that's good. I'm now officially the highest level in the game. That is so weird. That is so that's odd. what I mean, uh, you know, when you said you were like, I'm worried that I'm, a, I'm behind. I'm like, no, never. You shove out waves aggressively. Fear. You farm creeps fast. Like, okay, so let's say this is a somewhat real game, right? What that would mean is... <laughs> a somewhat real game. <laughs> <laughs> like, die true. Yes, I want to hear step two. It, given that it's real, not some sort of like a, mutant deformed actual, game. Like, yeah. Yeah. Then that draw would be just getting like railed. Because you, you'd have to imagine then you'd have to, like some pressure on the map, right? Yeah. If they were tri laning you mid, which they were, they were effectively tri laning you. And the only reason that worked is because. Because of a Bloodseeker. Like he doesn't, have to, he doesn't have to be there. I would have kept my bottle, by the way, and sold the null. What? Not stats for days? Oh shit, that's not good. It's okay, they can't go high ground anyways. Just don't die top. I'm gonna die top. Can't stop me. Alright. I am thinking of pulling all the way down to this bottom side in a moment. Sure, but eventually you guys have to fight them. What just happened? Oh, that. <laughs> <tries> <laughs> that. No problem. We'll be up in 40 seconds. Oh, yeah. So we should just be playing very carefully right now, given that they have. I would be pushing up bottom like a madman. Well, you know what? Let's go to bottom. I'm 
Okay. Should I kill this guy? No, never mind. Can you? I don't think I can. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna with tweet. Well, let me see who's here, because I just saw two guys in mid. Hi. Alright, he's out. Homie, don't play that. Okay. If they're top, you guys are fighting them. Because there's a Venno bottom. Fight top, Venno's bottom, Venno's bottom. Just go, just go, go, go. Okay. Because Venno's bottom, so it was 5 on 4. It's still 5 on 4. Here we go. I'm into this. Well, he popped BKB and he just got three shot. <laughs> Everyone's dying. Hang detection, detection. Your tower is under attack. Fuck this guy, I don't even need it, but I'm doing it anyways. It was so satisfying. RGQ is unbelievably upset right now. You're who? Oh, my mouse, Shakira. What? I'm running back here. That was such a good fight. Oops, I could have walked back. Yeah. HQ is just upset. <laughs> Anytime anyone does anything. Why are you there? What are you doing? I'm like, oh, I just wanted to kill people. It's a 4v5. Like, yeah. you're you're gonna lose the game if you just allow them to play like that, where they get to play two sides at once without getting punished at all. Like, yeah, they have a... They have a, whatchamacallit, they have an Aegis, but... You always take 4v5 fights, every single time. You don't have to tell me twice, that sounds great. Love that plan. You get two blood zone, you get a blood zone charge for Aegis death too. Really? Yeah. It's fucking wicked. When you play against a Wraith King and he's got an Aegis and his ulti up, you get three blood zone charges when you finally end his life. No. Come to me. I'm killing her, man. Oh, yeah. Uh oh. Remember, yeah, you can always zero. suicide. And I'm gone. <laughs> Hi, there it. it is. Got the suicide out. I mean, Bloodstone's really broken, right? Because if you're on a kill streak and you just die like that, it's like they wasted so much to do nothing. Um, do you think that was way too aggressive to try to kill that CM? Yes. You were so far. <laughs> okay. That was so incredibly deep. Yeah, I think that I have a bad habit of, if I'm starting to feel comfortable, being just too over-aggressive instead of just waiting for opportunities to happen, like you say. Yeah, the opposite should happen. Like, once you're, once you're ahead like that, you want to make sure that you're not dying. Because um, it means so much more when you do, you know? Yeah. Holy crap, you need a Lincolns after your shoes. I love a Lincolns. Sounds great to me. They thought you shadow bladed, that's why they popped us. Oh, I really wish I had that cast range right now. God, Bane is so cool. Oh, here we go. Please rupture somebody. Oh, be careful, Sean. I die real fast. I don't know why you guys don't buy detection. <laughs> this is, be this so is... hype. If somebody had a dust right now, I would feel comfortable in saying that I think you guys are going to win the game. And instead, Ooh. the literal opposite is happening. Oh, Alright, we have Marana down here. Marana's down bottom right, Bloodseeker. <sighs> Let him farm the neutrals first. <laughs> Alright, we're going to see what happens here. I believe. Alright, there's... 
I pinged it. I pinged it just in case. <laughs> awesome. See, it all worked out. And if you guys had detection, you wouldn't have had to die, and that would have been even more hype. I, I I gotta stop going so far forward though. Yeah. Let your uh let your let your Phoenix and your Jakiro or uh your gyrocopter lead. They're strong ass dudes. Yeah, I know what um gyrocopter does, but I don't know about his inherent stats very well. Steal all the farm. I think you guys are gonna win this game. Isn't that Man, insane? Hype. That's a high pass know. double down. All right, so let me speak out loud about safety. Okay. I'm. I think I. I think I need to pull back. Yes, sir. I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna fire once to keep my charges up. And okay, so there's not really a good place to push. So here is where I. I'm taking it. Here's where I will become a jungler. Dude, what is going on with this mouse today? It's just been today. Just today. I'm having mouse tracking issues. It's normally okay? Um, it sometimes acts up, but like, it's only ever really done that when I'm playing Hearthstone. What kind of mouse do you have? Steel Series Sensei. I see. I mean, I really like it, but, um, cats like to sleep on it, and most of the time it's like there's a visible cat hair in there. And that was there today, but I, I just don't know. I don't know why it's still acting up, because it looks clean. I don't know if it's that there's something on my mouse pad, or... Maybe it's just really deep in there. That would be really bad. But it would also explain why sometimes it literally just cuts out tracking. I saw one time you dragon slave in the opposite direction earlier. Yeah, no. Weird. Yeah, I, I dragon slave straight in the opposite direction. And I also completely lost tracking at some point and just straight died. Alright, so if Bane and Drow are there, going up here is okay? Oh. Alright, very well. Put a kibosh on that. That's what happened there. Yes. So I'm just going to stay here. There's not really a good place to push, but they're getting spread out. I really want to kill Bane because I just don't like him. Because he's so it's cool. He's cape, though. It's hard to kill that guy. Especially since I don't think anyone's ever going to carry dust on your team. Yeah, yeah, it's going to be a real challenge to get anyone with dust. Alright, I have four. I have Quattro, Bloodstone, Charger. They she's Moonlight Shadow. You can always suicide. Never, never underestimate the ability to suicide. Oh, it seems like such a bad idea. Yeah, hey. I have a Shiva's. I'm walking to go get it. I'm walking to go get it with no vision of the enemy. I believe in you. I believe in I, me as well. You're not gonna die here. Shiva's God. I was like, Shiva's I was actually so confident that there was no way you're gonna die there. Tell me about that. Where'd that confidence come from, and how do I get it? Because they're all bottom. Ah, that's excellent. why you want to aggressively push out top one wave. Even though Gyro's there. Uh, then you just wait. You want to get in position, bottom. All right, here's what you do. You just Shiva's, nuke back, and then you just chill. See what happens in the fight. If they overcommit for one of your teammates, then you want to fight, you know? Yes. But don't overcommit for the cause. Okay. Sir, yes, sir. Not overcommitting for no cause. All right, this guy's sacrificing some illusions. It feels good. That's 40 gold in your pocket that you didn't have before. Love it. I feel wealthy. Healthy and wealthy. Oops, that is the worst play Dragon Slave. Or, uh, White Striker I ever. We're playing some grindy Dota here, man. Yujikiro has 17 deaths? Yeah. Oh. And he's complaining a lot. It's okay. Yeah. This is, uh, this is really where you guys will shine. They are not bottom anymore. Yeah. And I am not there, so I think this is gonna go poorly for my friends. They're kinda doing it. Oh fuck. I fucked up my TP. 
They're doing it though. Just push out bottom. Go hard. Here I go. Do your best. Oh yeah. Oh. You can't really do anything. No regrets. Don't look back. I'm not. Don't. I I ain't gonna flinch. I ain't gonna flinch. Fuck that right. fight. You can't do anything about it. No regrets. Sometimes your Jakir just has to die time 18, you know, it happens. I have, I've had games like that, in fact I had one earlier today. Okay, now you're back. Really? I don't just take this thing down? I think I take this thing down. I think you want to fight that. Really? I think so? Yeah, I'm almost certain you want to fight that. You don't want to trade racks when you're behind a racks. You want to kill this guy. Didn't need to do that. You want to kill all of them, in fact. It? See? Backing was the play. Hype! Oh my god, I can't bl how do you do it? It's incredible! Oh my god, Blitz is growing stronger and stronger with every game I play. What if you're some sort of like Marvel supervillain, and whenever you give me an instruction that I follow, and it's correct, you gain even more power. I think That's it's actually- what's happening. It's then therefore my responsibility to, you know- To just keep fucking up. To just keep making <laughs> poor decision after poor decision. I mean, the universe is at stake, man. What if you- What if you gain too much from it? This is some next level mental gymnastics. Yeah. Uh, Are you. Uh, your shadow plays all last long enough. Not even close. Yeah. In that situation, though, um, you have to fight that. Like, if, if you don't fight that, the game wants them. Go on. Everyone hates each other. Oh. If you don't fight that though, like, the, the game just kind of... You mean the back yes. where I went to the, uh... Back to the racks? Yeah. Because it was a 3 on 3, right? Like, it's a pretty good odds that you win that fight, in all honesty. It's a good thing I got this team, man. Yeah, they're... they're legit as hell. They're just... zoning. Dude, this is the best team I've ever played with. The jungle bloodseekers come online. I See, know. You I'll created space for him. It all worked out. You created like a mountain of space for him. This was uh This was the plan all along. Everyone's dying here though. That's not good. Well we're all dead for an extremely long time, but we got some buybacks out of it. The lane's been pushed up. You're okay. You're up in 10. Yeah. Cheesecake's gonna hit that with the likes. Sell your note ticket. Uh, uh. So who's got buyback? What? Which of the homies are... Dude, just gyrocopter. Oh, fuck. Oh. Hop, oh. hop. I'm trying to get in there. Coming. Hop, up. Oh, you're so good trying at this Trying so bro. hard! I'm trying so hard! Ah! Uh, uh. Holy fuck. Dude, that Ethereal Blade Marana is a pain in the ass. It's okay. Go gotcha. There. Felt powerful and cool about myself. So I, I think I chuck the wand back and yeah, I just get should. this. Next spike, can you guys cancel fiend script? I take 1200 damage from it. I feel like your blood seeker is the right idea. Speed. I think you guys push together. I think that, I think I like that plan. I think I sell my wand and I begin to build towards this yes. big scary Lincoln Shvia. Let's all push down mid together, yeah? Much longer till five back seven minutes. Oh, oh! I'm going. 
Let's jam down mid, yeah. Woo! I got DD. I got DD. Alright, let's do that, yeah. Team's just going yes. over here, so I will go over here. Should I go bottom and push that out, you think? Uh, yeah. Let's do bottom shrine as fast as we can, and then let's push bot out. You just want to be somewhat close to your team at all times, so that yeah. if stuff does happen, you can respond to that. Do you think I should just build straight into this uh, Lincoln, or do you think I should start resaving for buyback again? Nah, just buy it, whatever. Fuck it, your YOLO! so long, CD. You say CD. Fire away. Invisibility. I really wish I had this cast range though. Shoot it. It would have been okay not to get it if you guys had like any reliable stuns. Be careful bottom. Get out now. Yeah. They're going to kill you. Yes. Do you know the trick, by the way? Um, the trick? You can TP and then Shadow Blade. Come bottom. They're all bottom. I'm going. All right. I, think we just fight I told you they're all bot. Fight Hydra. Because they weren't shoving out top. They were just running to try to kill you. Keep stepping out of his fucking silent circle. <laughs> they just TP'd out. Or at least Monica. Go bottom, go bottom, go bottom. Yo, yo, just get back. Two people were seen top and we have four, so I wanted to go kill. This team is this team is screaming. Woo! They can't get anything out of this though. You want your Phoenix to come back alive. Yes. I think in that case, by the way, at bottom, uh, you might just want to Shadow Blade Chase. See if there's anything there. Yeah. I'm gonna, I gotta keep remembering to throw out spells to keep the sting on. I don't like the blazes. Just always remember to Sheepas. That, that item owns. What makes it own so much? It just slows. It's like a pseudo AoE stun, yeah. since you guys have no stuns. Let's all gather it lowers, together. It lowers move speed too, by 40%. It's all great. Let me push out top a little bit. I don't know, do we really need to get aggressive? I think we just push out waves and wait for them to mess up, and everyone should stay relatively close together. Alright. Alright, I still think I'll do this one more time. Alright, let's back it up. Back out, back out, back out, back it up. I'm just gonna stay vaguely nearby Phoenix. How much do I need? 1k gold. You've cornered yourself, man. You look like you're grounded in the frame. <laughs> I'm like in rapt attention right now. I'm oh, emotionally no. invested in this game now. I mean, this is an important game. It's an important game it for is. all of us. Because if you're right I about it, know. I, know, I know how much more powerful that you'll grow. <laughs> la, 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 la. 
I Where actually feel like if you guys smoked right now, you would win the game. Anyone have a smoke? Yo, I think we should just get our items. Let's smoke it. Smoke. I think we should just smoke right now. I think we can do it. Because I need like a thousand more gold and all of this. <laughs> but... That was... Best smoke gank I've ever seen. Alright guys, we're doing a smoke gank. Here we go. Can't outrun a Yo, go on him. Oh, we gotta kill this, right? No, you don't. What, you're gonna kill her? Did you uh, catch yeah, dude, we got we got CM. I know, but I meant uh, with that ice pad. Oh, oh, oh. Also, didn't you watch? I thought you said you were emotionally invested in this. Oops, shut up. You have to keep my charges. I, I was like, I was watching the Jakiro show his shoot his ice pad. Ugh. Ugh. Is this really the push we want to do, guys? Yeah, yeah, this is it. This is the big one. Alright, here I go. Like crap, you guys just all lost like half your health. All right, let's back out. I don't think that's something you guys want to do. I think we need to get Roche. Like six Ben Awards. Dude. She oh, far off and buy back. oh yeah, I keep forgetting that this thing exists because I I can remember it in big team fights, but like just for general wave clear, man. Yeah, you can farm with it. It's nice. It's a nice, a nice little item. Oh yeah, come on, attack, come on. Yeah, that feels nice. Uh, if I'm you, by the way, I'm getting Bloodthorn next. Not Daedalus. Daedalus is fun. I don't like the blazes. Time to hunt. Do you think definitely Daedalus? Or excuse me, definitely Bloodthorn and not Daedalus? I just saw 40R get a lot of Daedaluses, and I like Daedalus on Lena because it's very straightforward. Uh, I think in this game, just Coming, 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 come on, I have detection, I have detection. They don't have a lot of BKBs, so it's okay. Oh, pick me up! Are you in his egg too? What the shit? Tell me this isn't working. Oh, it's working so good. Oh, it's working so good. Attack, for God's sake. Oh, it's all going as we want. Just... Ah! All right, so I should just top off, yeah? Yeah, and then you can just drop this. <sighs> uh, and what am I... Buyback. Shouldn't, should I buy the Shadow Blade just to have it? Uh, you mean the the soul the silk bridge? You can. Yes. Yeah. It's not bad. I mean, you're kind of well, item slot starved right now. So I yeah. But I, you don't have to right now. Like, yeah. just chill for now. Go TP to your team. Come on, mid. Yeah. What are the homies doing? Oh, the homies aren't trying to win. They're trying to lose. Oh, they could, you guys could have just won the game right now. Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know. Please. Okay, now you're back. I'm somehow invisible. This is great. No, you're good. You can't die. Oh, shit. Oh, this was scary. What the fuck? Oh fuck, I'm gonna die. That was a danger move. What the fuck? I don't... What what dealt so much damage to me? Uh, you got Venno ulted with Bale, I think. It's okay, they're uh... Hmm. They're getting Roche. Even though you guys could've just won the game. 
Yeah, I need to I need to not fuck that up. I need to not just like well, I feel like we should be going for it. I need to like watch yeah. my team more. It's weird. I feel like the game was just done there. I will be back. In fact, I know the game was done there because I just got to this point and none of them had buyback. So you guys just kind of win. Everybody dead? Cheesecake. We run. Huh. Hmm. It's okay, you're up in on. 12. No one is healed, so that's good. You have buyback too, right? Yeah. So. Get your slope bridge. Alright, let's go. On forever. Oh. Oh! <laughs> I can't believe you guys held. This game's so stupid. Just go, 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 go. Get back go, go, in there, Sean. Go, 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 go. There's so many gems everywhere. No, I don't. I do not have buyback. Nice Didn't you not use it? I used it. All right, let's get a blood thorn. Take like two seconds to get up. You might as well just yeah. <laughs> All right, push down mid. I don't think they have any buybacks. This game is so ridiculous. Like yes. the majority of them use buybacks. So. I go like the blazes. Yes. Oh, they're. They know. The enemy's middle ground. Should I go get to kill these towers? Just be kippy. Oh fuck. No, you guys are legit. He brought you into the sun, Sean. He brought you into the sun. I like the sun. The sun's cool. The sun's a cool place to be. The vendor's coming. Oh. Ugh. Just gonna keep ferrying stuff over to me. Come on, everybody. I think this is where you be careful a little. The team's not there. Yeah, just back out. Just back out. Get out. You guys don't have the gem anymore, right? Correct. You really need to jump right now. Should I just pull all like, the way back? Yeah, I think you just back. You don't want to throw the game here. Alright, well I'll just back in the middle of this. Like a oh my god. Oh, that Phoenix was so clutch. Oh, there's a gem on the ground! Pick it up, Sean! Okay. I have a so gem! This, this is where they Empire Strike back and try to push you back. But I feel like if you just hold one more time, the game is I wish I'd saved for buyback instead of just jammed my body full of quarter staffs. You had to. 
jam my body well, full of quarter stones. Well, you're not gonna be... You're not gonna have buyback anyways for a while. It's only been four minutes, so... That's a while. You're gonna farm the gold back. Or you're gonna lose or win by that time. This is a dramatic game. This is a dramatic outcome. For people who enjoy drama. Oh, we're still on the edge. Three wards in the shop. Oh, crap. Let's just play real careful. Oh wait, I'm fucking muted everyone, man. Who am I, who am I talking to? Quick. Knock the trees down. I gotta keep just no tasking time. these. To I cannot believe how this Stick game together. is going. Yes. Shove top one way. supposed to do this is this is better this is better entertainment than ti man the 63 minute lena game 63 minutes slug fest i mean this looks fun to play at least dude lena's always fun to play actually dota's always fun to play even those abominable games earlier were it always gets really fun is this too risky oh wait i don't have the range talent Arrgh! wait what I don't have the range talent. Oh, you mean the cast range talent? Yes. I was like, you didn't take the attack range talent? No, no, I desperately needed 6% spell amplification. <laughs> Fuck these trees. It's like, what did I sign up for? <laughs> yes, it just turns out I've literally been torturing Purge. I don't know, I think spell amplification's good. I mean, it's an extra. You never know how much 40 damage is going to change everything. Uh, just listen to me. I played StarCraft. <laughs> I would have lost it. I really would have. That would have been the point. Yeah, you've been like, fuck this. I'm out of here. Why did I ever offer this? You like, you friend break up with Kevin. Like, why'd you ever why imply you this was reasonable? Me? <laughs> uh, all right, here we why go. Is this guy in our lives. Okay, yeah. now you save for buyback for sure. In a minute thirty-five. How much gold are you away from it? Like a grand? Yeah. It's not bad. Oh, I can feel myself starting to get a little, a little fatigue. No, just keep focus. Yeah, that's all I gotta say. I actually up. think you guys should be favored to win this game right now with your heroes. Just because I think Phoenix is doing some real Phoenixy things. Phoenix is sick, dude. Well, Phoenix also has a gem. Do you think I should sub in my orchid? Does anybody have uh, an empty slot on your team? Just tell your Jakiro to drop his dust and give it to him. Remember, when you fight, just pop everything. Just pop off. Go wild. Or get the seat. Hey, Jakiro, put your dust in your backpack and pick up this gem of true sight. You want to make sure that you orchid one of the two spellcasters or the Veno. They're all missing. This is so worrisome. Oh, they're there. This doesn't look like the worst fight ever. This, in fact, looks okay. Oh my god. No wonder I muted that guy right at the start of the game. I'm taking a shitload of damage. So yeah, you guys got been able to... Roshan, tell your team to Rosh. Where'd your team go? Okay, know. you got a bag. Why does your team make so many... This is super decisions? standard for me, though. Yeah? Like, I feel like this and game could... Do I, should I like put Orchid away? I think so. Uh, yeah. 
guy actually lets you have the Aegis. No. Alright, cheese, let's go. Good enough. I would actually keep the orchid over the cheese. Really? Yeah. Really? How does that work? I think your damage is more important right now. Like, I, you do an insane amount of DPS right now. Yeah. You do 340 a hit or something. How long until you have buyback? What's up? You have the gold for it too? No. I need 531. Oh my gosh. I don't know what happened to that, to our Gem of Truth site in mid. Alright, I buy that. What the hell? You're like 500 gold and now you have it? Because that bounty ring gave you like 200 gold. Wait, it goes up? Yeah, over time. What? Are you fucking kidding me? I thought it was just 80 all game long, man. I'm wrong. I'm fucking. I don't know stuff. Wait, when did it give you 80? Like at the start of the game? Doesn't it give you like 80 ish? No, it gives you 100. And then it goes no. back down. Does, doesn't it give you? Doesn't it give you eighty? No, it gives you hundred, and then it goes back down, and then it wraps back up, like a curve. I don't. I don't know where that gem went. You know, you're the highest net worth in this game. I would assume by a considerable margin at this point. Just you know, flame on. Flame on. <laughs> in a game full of people, I have blocked. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, team! I need to do something! Dota is actually identical to the rest of the world. It's not unique to Dota. Try to get stuff done on a project, man. But I bet no. they all take credit when they win, if you guys win. In a project, no one, no one on your team will carry dust. No one will smoke. Your team will leave you to die. Classic team I feel fights. like you guys should fight them. You have Aegis. You, guys you have Aegis and buyback. Nah, I think you should smoke up. Do it. If you if you fight them head on, they're just gonna spam snakes at the ground, and you're gonna be stuck in step one. Yes. Well, I'm not sure what to do then. You smoke. You try to fight them in their jungle or something. Remember, you've got cheese. But well, what do I swap in for the cheese? Like, if you're dying, anything. <laughs> but well, it'll, it'll, it'll take six seconds, though. Nothing. Nothing at all. They know. There they be. We're all here, guys. Hey. Oh. Alright, I'm so emotionally invested in the success of myself. Do you really want to lose a 70 minute game? My preference would be no. Don't get arrowed. Oh no, he's teeping back. What's going on? I, don't I know. guess you guys get out now? If your Bloodseeker dies twice, I'd be incredibly sad right now. Oh, yeah. Get Let's out, see. guys. Homies, evacuate. Homies, evacuate. I have never heard those two words used next to each other. Hey, GD. You guys are like somehow getting further and further away from your gem carrier. Oh, there's a fight going on. Yeah, really bad. It's okay, your bullet seeker is Aegis. You need to get to him though. He's just dropped the sun. Is it successful? I'm coming up. Oh! Is it? What oh my the God, fuck? Like, oh. Holy shit! That's so funny! Oh my God! That was the dumbest thing. They all stood right there and whacked at it. How's that happen? 
How does that happen, man? I think there was some sick uphill misses. Oh my god, this game. It's stressing me out. Yeah, I know, it's, it's hard for me too. I for you. No, oh god, I don't mean to ruin this for you. Oh, they full on buyback. Just get out. They five man bot back. Jibate them. If they overextend, you can kill them. Oh, I don't give a damn, dude. I'm Never gonna mind. Play, I'm gonna play this most boring way possible. Up. Oh. oh shit, you lost a Rex. Oh, I know. Fucking, it's such a disaster. But they actually, I think they actually five man bot back. It's five or four. That was a straight up five man buyback. Kira's trapped. In here with us. I ah, zoning. He's so I think I push this one more time. Oh, they're going for it. Oh, this is so hype, but you all have buybacks. So this is a crazy, this is a crazy idea. So now I do one more, right? Do one more and then TP back? Uh... Yeah... I'm fucking scared, I'd just dude. back now. Yeah, I'd back now. <sighs> do you have enough? Yeah. Hey! Oh, you're so strong now. Okay, baby. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right, let me ask if someone wants this cheese. Hey, does someone want this cheese? Like and unmute all those people. I mean, I can take it if you don't want it, but being yeah, I'm I'm six slotted. Here you go. on Bloodthorn's fucking long. That's not real, right? I don't think so. You guys fighting? They're fighting! They're fighting! Help them, Sean! Where? Where are they fighting? Never mind. There were illusions. You mean it's really small for me to see on your screen? Oh shit. Oh, that one's real. Is this too dangerous? Nah, don't worry about it. Oops. Fuck worry up. about it. Oh, super I, worry about dude, it. I, dude, that was. You know what? I blame. I blame the unmuting. I just shouldn't even been out of here. It's okay. What was I doing? I think if you stunned him first, he would have died. Uh, well, I think that it's it's the same problem that I had before, where I just saw my team down there and just assumed that they'd be going up. I need to just be more cognizant of it. I'm just I'm just used to playing like on a Discord that has a bunch of people that are like just like, all right, let's go here, and literally no one ever doesn't do it, and it's just a bad habit I've put myself in. It's okay. Hmm. I don't think they can push because if they push and they lose, then the game just ends. Phoenix is, I think, one of the coolest heroes in the entire game. I love Phoenix so hard. That ulti is... Oh. It's so sweet, dude. It's to die for. He he honestly saved you guys the game at, like, two different points. Oh, yeah. He's great. I mean, the egg, view, but I like the egg mid. Now that Lena's back up, can we smoke and maybe try to find him? He saved you in the Bloodseeker. Yeah, that was sick. That. Yeah, let's just push the waves out a little bit and then, then go. You still have buyback, right? Yes. To battle. Yes. It's like 78 minutes of the game and your Bloodseeker's still reluctant to smoke with you. Okay, let me push this out one more time. <laughs> like a wild fire. <laughs> push out I can't even... Okay, I got silver. There you go. Let's do it. 
You need a lead with your gems. Do you have a gem carrier lead? Oh. Fuck is this team? Oh. What's going on? Is he dead? Oh, we killed one, for God's sake. Well, he doesn't have buyback. And they don't have a gem now, so your Shadow Blade's gonna be the king. Oh my god, dude. Jakira is refusing to pick up the. It's all good. Oh no. Yo, Venno's bot. Let's take it. Oh, Venno's trying to make the, the plays. Oh, fuck. How, how, how do I do this so consistently? It's okay. He's gonna egg you. He's gonna bring you to the sun! You're gonna be reborn? I love being reborn. Being reborn is my favorite thing. Here comes the sun. The game's over, by the way. You won. I'm, I, I will find a way. No, you can't. Hit the buildings. Oh my god, we did it, we did it. Watch out for arrow. They <laughs> have just... no buybacks. I can just buy back in less end. Fire away. Oh Beast it on. I feel so okay at this game. I feel yeah, alright. You, you got our points back. I say we because I feel like this was at this yeah. point. Yeah, no, it's I mean group effort. I really, truly feel that the reason we were able to win this is because at around two minutes into the game, I pushed in my lane at mid, which gave me the opportunity to get the extra last hits that I needed. We did it. Hey, you bought a lot of space for that jungle bloodseeker. God, that's, I think, one of the hardest things I've ever done in my life. Like, getting a degree in college, grad school? Nah, no, nah, I played a 80-minute game of Dota one time. Hey, that was your double down, so... Feels good. You had to. You had no options. Yuck. Holy shit, man. That was a plus 50 -er. Oh, that's, that feels good. Hey. My god, we got pooped on early. Doesn't matter, though. Like, because you were able to shove lanes and the Marana wasn't. Yeah, I always go back and look at the graphs to, to sort of, like, double check my sensation at the time with what was actually happening at the time yeah and at this point in the game i thought that i was getting absolutely dumpster enode um and i was look at that it doesn't really so the thing is is the way that the game plays out if you just get like one kill on marana the game sort of just it even stevens like there was one point like at 30 minutes or something where you guys were like pretty much tied in net worth or some shit you remember when you said, it was like, at that point where you said, I feel like I'm so far behind, and I was like, you're not. Like, not at all. And you really weren't. Gotta go ahead and hit him with the down dudes. Okay, gets a thing. Dude, this Phoenix. Holy shit. He gets the tip of Rose. Oh. He deserves your points. Dude, that Phoenix. Commend Phoenix. Tip Phoenix. He you saved your Phoenix. 3k. Yeah, feels good. All right, woo! We're back to where we started. Look at this. Oh, oh, that sweet, sweet plus fifty. It was very satisfying. Hey, you want you want to go again? You ready ready for round two? All right, let's do it. Let's. I just want I just want one normal game of Dota while I'm here. You want a, a single normal game of Dota? I don't know if I can assure you that. I don't know if I can make that promise happen. Well, I mean, I'll try. I'll try my hardest. I want I want to give this to you. It's important to me to give it to you. So game one, Sniper steals your... He feels the need to steal your... Your courier. For God knows whatever reason. Oh my god! You know you know, in all three games, they picked up a DD at the two minute mark, by the way? Really? Has it been all yeah. three? That's weird, right? The Murana... Yeah, because the, the Murana was getting dumpstered, and then she... She found a DD rune and got like three denies in a row on you. Huh. Fucking Dota. Do you remember that? She actually just grabbed a DD and then just I, denied like three creeps I under you. I do now recall. I do not have as quick a memory with it as you do, but damn. And then, yeah, Tinker and Tinker did that, man. Shit. 
I think the funniest part about this game though was when everyone was running around with like 100 health and your blood seeker was just there was a moment in this game that was just insane to me where is dude it was when they were all wailing on the phoenix egg and it landed and got like four immediately Oh my god, we're, we're, people in chat are saying, man, I'm exhausted after that game, I'm done. Oh, it's so funny. You know you know what is the greatest way to gain additional Dota energy? What, win games like that? Uh, it's to have an air conditioner. Because <laughs> if you have an air conditioner, like for me, it's when I get into a game and like my pulse goes up. Yeah. And it starts to get a little hot, and I'm, like, not drinking any water, and I'm, like, not moving, and I'm just intensely getting in the zone, and then all of a sudden it's 85 degrees in my room. It's the worst, but when you have that, you see you have that? AC blowing? Hmm. Did you see that question in trivia? What is the cost of Daedalus? Yeah, no, and it was, like, 500? 100, 200, 300. <laughs> what is the base movement speed for Underlord? Okay, um... I believe it is... Jesus, what is the base movement speed? Is it actually 315? I have genuinely no idea about Damn. any of the base stats in Dota. Alright, well, by the way, this is my cat. This is Sheriff. Sheriff is a very good cat. Sheriff likes to snuggle. Sheriff? Yeah, isn't that the greatest cat name? How many cats do you have? You have two? Two? I got a Sheriff, I got a Despy. One's brown, Despy? one's gray. Yeah, Despy. What is that from? Desperado. Oh, yeah. Wow. I've I've not called that cat Desperado since the day I got her, man. I was like Desperado, that's, that's a cool name. Hi, Despy. God, look at this. Look how good this cat is. See, she just she's pushing her head into my head. She's snugging on me. She checks Damn. in on me a few times the stream, you know. Minus the whole cat hair in the mouse. Yeah, I it was continuously better over time. Uh, <laughs> There was, it was just like one game that like really ruined my entire life. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, what a good cat. Uh, you know what? I think we're first picking Lena, depending on if anyone else. Do you have another double down? I don't know. Do you accumulate them? You usually get like, uh, depending on what your battle level is, you usually get uh, one to three. I didn't realize that I could have consecutive double downs. Yeah, I get three a week, and I very often lose them all in a row. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Relax, scarf cat. That's very. That's a very good scarf cat. I would like to pick fourth. I just say weirdly specific shit like this because in pub games it just works. So I want to pick fourth. Oh my god. Yeah, just like the the percentage of time when I'm like, I would like to pick. All right. If no one else is picking, I'm picking. Oops, er, boop. How did this game feel, by the way? Um, How did the landing feel? Let me try to remember what even happened in that. I really feel like my opponent was one of the better people I've ever been against in mid. The Marauder? Was... Yeah, he was actually quite good. Um... The things that speci specifically felt good was that I would... Was the deaths where I came back and did not feel like that much bad happened. And yeah. especially because I was like 399 when I was trying to buy my boots. And it just hurt so much to not quite be able to get it. The only um, time... Uh, I think the, the only death that kind of felt bad was when after you had died, they just like dove you again at the tower. Like you just respawned. <laughs> yeah. The tower. All right, sweetheart, we're gonna deposit you. Ow! All right, oh, so they we have, have a Huskar. Okay, Huskar feels real bad to play against. Nah, you'll be okay. All right, we're gonna, we got a jungle axe. <laughs> you got a jungle axe. <laughs> oh god! Why does that shit never happen to the enemy team? Why is it only you? I just wanted one normal game so we could see what we learned and the application. And instead, there's going to be a jungle axe. So you're going to get tri-lane mid. <sighs> get me out. 
get me out of here. It felt like the CS felt a lot more clean. I, I will tell you the one mistake that you made. more clean, yeah. Uh, the one mistake that you made is, you know when you were on top of your hill and you went for the DD? I actually think he wouldn't have gone for that DD rune if you nuked the wave. Oh, I remember that now. Yeah, I... I don't have a good memory for specifically what happened during the laning phase. Straight yeah. up. It's okay. That's what I'm here for. Because I... I do. It's a practice skill, right? I feel like I'm stepping towards an understanding of it, though, which is very nice. Good. I, I mean, the biggest thing is, um, I could tell... I can tell now when you feel bad that you made a mistake. Like, almost instantly, when you played the last game, it felt like uh, you were picking up like almost immediately when you knew you fucked up in, in what I wanted you to do, and then I didn't really have to say too much. That's great to hear. Um, yeah. There is something, by the way, um, so I wish you had watched the other video I sent you. So You're gonna keep bringing that up, huh? Is this how this relationship's gonna be? Wait, why do you have, have a... You? Why do you just support watch techies? Uh, no, we don't have a support at all. We actually just have a techies. Okay. Huh. Hey, what are you doing for the next 80 minutes? I'm playing with some techies. Yes, I'm playing with some techies. So checked out now. I, you have a jungle checked axe. Out. Checked out. Checked out. Techies. Like, hey, could I have two tangos? Maybe one from Techies, one from. Uh... Oh wait, my God! You click double down rank. What does it say? Huh? Oh here, wait one second. Oh, you have zero. You only get one. Oh, what a sweetheart! See, it is a support Techies. He's legit. Oh, the greatest Techies player of all time. All right, I gotta make better use of that. So I get a slav. I get a this. I get a that. Patience from Joe. <laughs> Patience from Joe. Who do you think I'll be up against in mid? Huskar? Um. Or what the hell is our lineup? I guess it's Huskar. Like, by default, it's Huskar. No, he's offline, I guess. Huskar is? I'm just gonna watch this happen. Coming, coming, coming. Oh, that's Doug. I thought you were gonna blade fairy in, Doug. Yeah, a real normal game of Dota that I get to watch. Don't push too hard in. I'm going back to my run. Do I have enough time for this? I'm going. I have no idea if I can actually get here in time, or whether I'm going to be yes. early or late. I have no idea. Look at this! Look at this! I'm so sick! I'm the sickest player in the entire universe! Four. Three, and now you have plenty of time, actually. Okay, okay, here we go. Here we go. Oh, no! Fuck! Okay, I'm going. I'm going with it. Okay, I messed up my block. I messed up my blade. Now you're good. Oh no, never mind. Ugh. I mean, at least you have a jungle axe, so this is being punished, right? This is where my extra long range is going to be super helpful to me. Oh. Open fire. I mean, he the Wind Ranger has like a hundred health. Like, what's going on? Yeah. I'm going. Dota's going on, my friend. <laughs> Oh, the CSing is nice though, despite uh, the weird dueling shenanigans. See, this is what makes me scared to push the lane in. Oh, you're okay. Should I put this? Well. Yeah. Ugh. I'm under attack. Nope. Thank God, it actually went off. Missing punch. That sucks a little bit. Yes. Not a lot, though. You're about to hit level 3 and then you can shove the wave in. 
The ogre's fucking off now. If you notice, he's at top. I did not notice. Thank you. He's going for the rim, maybe? Oh, maybe not. Remember, two hits, stop. I'm just gonna do this. You got the rune at you, yeah, I got it. I get cool. I didn't need to do that, but that's what I did. What do you deny? Oh, come on. Oh, come on. There's a regen rune at top, by the way. If you want to shove the wave and grab it. Yeah, I'm gonna hit. I, see, I hit the range two times like this, and then yeah. I shove. I don't know if this is. It's fine. Oh, no DD rune for enemy mid player. Yes! Yes! Praise We're the best player in the whole world! See, now he's just missing a bunch of CS under the tower. The tower's your friend, dude. I love this tower. Be your friend. So good to have a tower in my life. Oh, perfect new. Oops, sell this. Yes. Come the fuck on. Got orange coming, dude. Oh! Bless up, fam. Okay, I can, I can feel my legs. We had one normal game. That's all I wanted. The the lane went excellent. Even though you started off getting dual laned and now there's three heroes in your lane and I'm going. You've got a jungle axe and a support techies, like I don't care anymore. It worked okay. out shock. Oh worked my out. god, we too fucking did a thing. Oh Jesus. Alright, I, I don't know. I think I just play really far back right now. Yeah, yeah, now you chill. Just hope for top rune. Uh it's bottom. You're so screwed. Fuck it, I'm doing it, man. There's less than any chance that you're getting there before that punch. Oh, go the yeah, yeah, is, yeah, is this the normal yeah. play that I should be yeah. trying to do every time? Fuck your darks here. He doesn't need that shit. Yes. Use your bottle charges and then oh, yeah. bottle throw. Oh, yeah. I... Dude, fuck the rest of your team. Like, what, did, what have they done for you lately? Dude, my team is great. I believe in my team. I believe in their ability to do things with their abilities. Your team this way. decided to jungle so that you got dual late mid. They deserve everything that comes to them. This is really bad. Fuck this. Mine. I will say you should almost never use your uh, stun in the early game. It won't yeah, make an no, impact I, on your CS. I, I, I panicked. I panicked. I locked up. I freaked out. I fucked up. Oh my god, I fucked up. I freaked out. I panicked. <laughs> After this wave, um... Really? Yeah, that was weird. Okay, here's what you do. Save your bottle charges, push out the wave, and then um, I would walk around and shrine. Really? Yeah, I would shrine. Wait, uh, you do that right now still? Yeah, I would. Wow, okay. Well, I mean, I'm obviously not doing it right now, I'm trying to figure out what yeah. the fuck I'm supposed to be doing. Now I would actually just go back to base. Oh, holy oh, mother of god. I got so lucky just there. What the hell's going on in this game? Dude. Why is there just like three people? Actually, I don't even know why I'm asking that. Of course there's three people in You have a jungle axe. Yeah, no. Th this isn't that my teammate's weird. It's that matchmaking works. Did I just... Uh, also, I think I'm instead of going for the soul ring, I'm just going for the boots it's fine. first, the arcanes. Uh, so I kind of know. I actually sort of agree with you, but what was your reasoning? Uh, for what? For going for uh, the boots this game. Oh shit! It's not. Um, because, well, I, I I'm it's, it's gonna hurt to for me to share the answer. But it's okay. that I um, like to get the soul ring if I am jungling. Okay. Because I can jungle faster. 
Um, but since this game, I feel like I'm going to be in lane pushing more. Is that is that just the most appalling reasoning you've ever heard? Is that what's happening? No, that was actually like the exact reasoning. Oh, no way. Yeah, the, <laughs> that's why I didn't contradict you at all. Well, sometimes Kevin does this thing where he hears me, and then I can just hear what it's attached like, to the corpse. Did you see that shit? That was amazing. I don't know why he keeps throwing those out. It's just giving you wand charges and it's he has a wasting bottle. his mana. Yeah, but it's like. Every spell counts in Dota. Ooh, nice triple CS. Oh god, I'm so ashamed. Yeah, that one I was a little disappointed in, I'll be honest. Yeah, no, it's you know, Kevin does this thing when 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 I when I say or do something that he just cannot wrap his head around, there's just yeah. silence for a few seconds. <laughs> I'm doing this because of this reason. And he goes Yeah. Yeah, you don't you don't want to do that. <laughs> have you ever uh, have you ever played with his friends? No, never. Oh really? No. Okay. That's probably for a reason. Go go get the rune. Yeah. He has a we have a mutual friend named uh, Chachi. I've seen him online in games with this Chachi fella. Yeah. And whenever Chachi fucks up, Kevin just like has a deep sigh. He doesn't say anything. He just. Goes, <sighs> I want this. Okay, so I don't know if this is bad, but no, that was good nuke. I would have done the same. I think the only difference between us, like overall, big picture wise, is I don't use stun ever to see us, and you do. Well, I used it once. I used it once. I've seen you use it twice in two, three games now, dude. Ah, oh, so I'm so ashamed. So I actually kind of want to go up this way. Yeah, that's fine. Not, not a lot of actions happening here. Uh. Isn't ready for this. Man, you're not okay. Go, go shrine up. Go shrine up. Oh, oh, shit. oh Jesus. Oh, go back to base. Go back to base. We'll get back. Oh. I did a thing. I did a, I did a thing semi successfully, dude. Yeah. My you last did. hit count seems really. No, it's fine. Really? Eat the shrine. Oh yeah. Uh, it's fine. It's too late by now. Well, I mean, you're kind of getting like dual lane half the game. Your expectations are gonna change based on that, right? Like. Yeah. I wouldn't go bottom, by the way. I just go back. Mid. Yeah, I'm just. Oh, I'm not even not even drinking from my bottle. <gasps> If I get dual lane mid and I get at least 50 CS, I feel okay about my life. Light him up. There are a few CS that I know you Woo. already know that you could have done better. We won't talk about that. Yes. Hey, there's no point. Quick. Check See. the top. No. It's bottom. Touch has it. Attack. Temperature right. Oops. This was just, this was all bad. That was all bad. <laughs> don't even talk to me. I don't want to hear it. <laughs> Alright, that time I might have stunned. I kind of would have been okay with it that time, Sean. Okay, okay. Iteration, iteration. Just for the sake of that. Oh shit, this guy's. Did you kill him here? Guess not. You're okay though. He can't kill you. Yeah. Oh man. If only right. Gosh, I just I just wish I did more damage than I thought I did. It's fine. Just solo zone two euros out. See that I have absolutely no sense for how to even evaluate if it was good or bad. You know, I can kill this guy. The the ogre one is really optimistic, <laughs> considering um you know, you don't have, you don't have phase boots or anything. Like, if you have phase, he's dead. But uh, the Wind Ranger one, I was okay with. He pop shrine. It's okay. You feel really strong right now, or you should have at least. Oh yeah, I feel great. Yeah. Fuck. Holy crap. You have a lot of wand charges. Yeah, just use them. Okay. 
Maybe I just should have turned around and fought to the death there. Nah. I think, um... I think I would have tried to run too. It was... A bit unexpected for you to die there. I'm not sure how that happened, but... It's okay. Got him. It's not that big of a deal. That death doesn't mean too much. Yeah, so I learned that... that you wanna push it in. Oh shit, this jug is getting fucking destroyed by Huskar. Holy crap, that's level 10 Huskar. He's the yeah. same level as you are. Jesus. Alright, I'm gonna keep pushing it in. Okay, your jungle axe is gonna uh, salvage this. For sure. More like support techies. See, here's what. This is what I would previously do before today's lesson, as I would come over At here this point a in lot. The game, yeah, at this point in the game, it's fine. Like, the laning phase is past. Oh, this is perfect. You need to kill it. Thumbs up. Two out of two stars. It's just like, in the in the laning phase, of course, like, oh in the first four minutes, you don't want to have to do this. But at this point, like, when the lane is shoved in, like, yeah, the game changes. I mean, we didn't really talk about that, but, because I didn't want to focus on too much stuff. But I think you're getting ganked, by the way. Yeah, I see a little Ogre Magoo. Oh my god, dude. This character is so powerful. Scario? I believe. Nice. We're all rich. Actually, I don't want to get this. I don't want to get this. Just got a solo okay. triple kill. Your entire team just died, by the way. Who got a solo triple kill? The Huskar. Oh, that piece of shit. Yay! Good top? Um. Shit. Well. I feel like oh, I fucked up. I'm actually just gonna come over in jungle here. Actually, I should be using this right now, anyways. Die, everyone. I don't know if you think this is in in poor taste to be doing this maneuver. It's okay. Oh. Huh. And you can actually get him. That is so lucky. Oh, flee. Leave that man to die. You're not his. You're not your brother's keeper. Oh my goodness! Can I actually kill this guy? I am no, so lucky close. again. Oh my god, Huskar just feels like the most insanely powerful hero to me. Hey, I got a kill. Nice. I mean, he well, was one on one against a juggernaut, right? As an offlane Huskar. In yeah, that dude. situation, yeah, he's gonna be. There's a lot of heroes you could stick in his position that would feel incredible. If I'm to be honest. Oh, why aren't you not old? I just came off full end. Chug's going a little deep. Christ, Chug. That's a little late. Your hero's horrible against Huskar right now, though. Yeah. Holy fucking moly. I think I go bottom to push. I will. I will claim. Actually, let's. The element of surprise is strong with me. You are totally. You are like sinking deeper into that chair. How long have you been awake at this point? <sighs> something like thirty something hours. Holy cow! How are you still coherent? I like start to just fall asleep by pulling all nighter. I mean, I'm probably gonna play some solo queue after this, man. How? 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 Dude, I literally cannot stay the fuck away. One time. Please, one time. I keep being convinced that I can kill her. Kill him, excuse me, the Ogre Magoo. 
<laughs> Have you been convinced that you can now? Yeah, I, I keep feeling like I'm way stronger than I am. I think it's just because I am in a good position, but I'm not level 15 yet. Yeah. Don't throw your... So, you're throwing away your lead a little bit, but you're still okay. So don't... Uh, don't get tilted. Like, everything's fine. You know what the crazy part is? Hmm. Your bloodstone last game, though, despite you going, like, 2 and, like, 5, is going to be faster last game than it was this game. Really? Yeah. Huh. By, like, a full minute and a half, if I had to guess. Which is weird, right? Because you probably feel better in this game. Uh, not after the last two deaths. Maybe Fuck this is maybe. Agents. But this is... yeah. Nice. I've been more efficient with the charges, but why be efficient when you can just blow stuff up? You know what I mean? This is okay. I don't see anything wrong with this. Thank you. Me neither. Well, I'm gonna wait just a second to get that point booster. Oh, I thought that stone was gonna hit. Does he have a DD? Oh, he's still dead! Sean, run! We've had so many bad experiences with that man. I know, I don't trust him anymore. Alright, wait, wait, before you shine. Yes. Oh, you're doing it, never mind. Yeah, yeah, there it is. Look at it, it's I... happening right before our eyes. You moved. Okay, move something. it back. Move it back. Move it back. Move, move what back? Your items. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course, of course. So are. as soon as you start the shrine, you can just uh, move them back. Because the six second cooldown will inter uh, overlap, I mean. Oh, yeah. With the shrine usage. Open fire. Ugh. 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 You know what? I better get the fuck out of here. So the biggest thing, Sean, that you're going to learn especially about Dota nowadays is neutral creeps feel really bad to hit. Ancient creeps feel really good to hit. Fuck. Oh god, you're so, so dead. dead. I'm the most dead man. Holy crap. Okay, what what is a good item to buy against that guy? You're going to buy you're going to buy your typical stuff like silver edge. You're going to be fine. I mean, your axe almost has blink, right? Uh, uh, he's halfway there. Dude, I gotta learn me some Huskar, man. I love lane bullies as characters. They're so fun. What, what position is Huskar typically played in? One. I feel like this is abnormal, though, because... That Huskar was against a solo juggernaut top while your techies walked around the map planting mines and your axe hit the jungle creeps. So it's it's a little unrealistic to expect this kind of game all the time. It's okay, we, we double down on the good game. Yeah. Oh, this poor techies. I'll miss him so much. Really? I mean, that guy last picked techies, dude. He saw the heroes and then he picked it. Yeah. I mean, he did an analysis of it. He saw what he was up against. He made the judgment. He says to himself, I don't need any sort of stun. What's with your teams and not picking stuns? I don't ever pick stuns. This is why I like to pick stuns a lot. It's so crazy to me. Anyone? Are we just going to lose everything? We're losing everything, dude. Fucking losing, man. Mid is like gonna go down. Give me the bloodstone. Kill him. Oh, he doesn't have mana, but he somehow won anyways. That's amazing. Got a lot of spins off in a row. Holy crap! This game looks ten times rougher than any of the other games you played, aside from the one where your jungle axe abandoned. La 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 la. 
Don't be a pussy, hit that tower, Sean. Turn around and kill this guy. Oh you gotta make God. some real risky place to uh, pay off your debts. Ah, oh, it's Clown Man! Oh, I'll play them all! No! I hit X! God damn it! I don't know why I didn't go off. I think I actually cancelled my animation or some shit. <laughs> or hit it before my, my R. It's okay. I believe in positivity and love. That was <sighs> kinda close. Uh, feels good. Alright, we, we are going one by one out into the wilderness. You gotta create space for your team. That's what I mean. You gotta do some real crazy shit if you're gonna win this. Oh, you want crazy shit? I got you covered, man. Don't you worry about a thing. Just kind of do whatever, uh, whatever floats your boat at this point, because I genuinely have no idea how you recover. No, okay, remember. Imagine, what would be the worst thing that my opponents could do to let me into this game? Uh... They feed you like a triple kill. Okay, that's the play then. By like um, diving in. It's gonna be so sick to farm these ancients. Okay, here we go. Okay. Watch the magic happen, my friend. Guys, let's gather mid and make some magic happen. On the move for some. Oh! That is truly magical, it just happened. birds celebrating being alive. What a great bird. You always gotta kill the dad first to establish dominance. A parent should never have to let their children die. Oh boy. Oh. Try to get out of there. Dude, Mask of Madness feels real good on Luna. It is incredible. You're gone, dude. You're not even in the picture frame anymore. You have, like, sunken below. I mean, I'm really... I can't believe this is the third game I've had to watch somebody jungle in your pubs. Dude, this is... I, I can't believe you're surprised. I, I am so surprised that you're surprised. I just... I don't understand it. Okay, here's the thing. At least last game, that guy had the last pick, and he picked a support, right? Yeah. But this game, why did he decide that Techies was the hero? The world! <coughs> oh man, never know. Oh, and being up against the Luna is real painful, man. You guys can't team oh, fight them because up. you don't have the heroes for it. Alright, you gotta make some real wild play, Sean. Alright, what's a wild play? Because I can make bad plays. Yeah, just do it. Just high risk, low reward. Here we go. That's the beginning. Beginning of the end? Or the beginning of the beginning? No, start racking them up. Get like 14 bloodstone charges. Oh, dude. I actually dodged a hook. I am fucking sick, dude. It is unreal how good I am at this game. Me, you I'm might invisible. be the best person I've ever coached. That's really good. Wait. That includes the pros. What? I was I invisible! Just saw you got hooked. Oh. No! No, it can't be! It can't be! Please tell me I'm still the best. Please, I need this. I need to be like the number one. 40 second circle jerking you, only for that to happen. Oh god, we gotta make it. We gotta, we gotta make it a longer circle jerk. That's what it needs to be. At least the beginning was sick. Yeah, the beginning felt great. We did every... You know, even while you were getting dueling, 
You shoved the wave, you picked up the rune, everything went great. You cs properly, you got some of them. Yeah, I mean, I was, I was up against two humans. Two, I was up against a giant blue Ogre Magoo. We were up against uh, the ever flat firing Wind Ranger, Wind Runner, whoever she may be. It was okay. I, I actually feel kind of comfortable about this game. This probably one was the, the best laning one so far today. By like gotten a wide better. margin. We've gotten even better over yeah, time. On, uh, yeah. I feel like they're, we are getting better at this though. Like things are getting more smooth in general. I'm glad you see the logic behind the salve, by the way. Super I feel like cool. it's helped you Kill quite him. a bit. Oh! Alright. Here's the comeback. Meanwhile. Get in there, Sean. It doesn't matter, ignore that guy. Someone could come help bot when you guys are done. When you guys are done. Like they're doing laundry or some shit. They're folding their clothes. Ooh, nice stuff. Oops. Oh, we're doing it. That Huskar keeps randomly dying to you guys. Maybe if he does that like four yeah. more times, you guys can come back. <laughs> Darkseer is just yelling loudly. What is he saying? Uh, it's unclear, but he's So I assume I assume he's upset. I assume it would be my presumption that he's uh, probably kind of mad at your axe. Oh, Juggernaut. Juggernaut's the one he's upset with. How's he mad at the Jug of all people? Because the Jug was there on the other side and just being there and whatnot. So I mean, what can you what can you expect? All right, here we go. All right, this is the Christ moment. Is Run. Get it, girl. Holy fuck! That was la, wild. La, 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 la. Are you gonna die too? I believe in you. Get to the shrine. Yeah, I think they just have like way too much damage. That Luna has an incredible amount of farm right now. This Luna she has almost a amazing. full butterfly manta mask of madness dragon lasts in 25 minutes. Holy shit! It's been a while in any bracket that I've seen that much farm. This Luna played phenomenally. 11 and 0. Jesus. Yeah, because like every single time there was anything occurring anywhere on the map, Luna was just pushing a lane or farming or basically doing all the things that you have been suggesting that I do. <laughs> it's. I mean, this game lineup wise is. God, I wish you had another double down token. That'd be hype. This is not a real guy. Yeah, it is. Woohoo! Alright, let's see if I can kill him. One time, one time! Oh! Oh! We're gonna get him! We're gonna get him! I should've been attack moving or some shit. Yes! Toasted! Do they have mega creeps? Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's okay though. The, the Huskar's feeding. Tell your team, hold strong, man. Guys, never give up, never surrender! Stay strong. This is all part of the plan. I know. I know. It's okay. We got the comeback coming. I feel... Mm, I probably don't need a Maelstrom. Probably actually pretty bad to get Maelstrom right now. Get a Silver Edge. Woohoo! I get the kill! It's all about me. I'm the man. Uh, what do I want? I want the Silver... You circled back to being the best player in the world again for me. That's good. That's good to hear. It's good to hear. I always had confidence in myself that I that I was in fact the number one. It's it's a trait I see in myself every day with each activity I try to embark upon. I'm just the best. I can't fucking hit this Luna, dude. You're the oh, humblest, shit. smartest. It's hard to be this humble, I will say. It's not something a lot of people can get away with, but I just do it no problem. I was cracking my knuckles and I'm about to die to fucking creeps. Oh shit, I'm brave though. I'm gonna keep fighting. Bravest. Number one. Most foresight. 
I have so much foresight. Gives you junglers to try to hold you back, Sean. It's okay. You know what I need to do? I'm gonna jungle in my next game. I'm just gonna watch it go down. I think I have enough health now. All right, here we go. Remember, I said kill the Huskar four times at least. You guys can win. There we go. Oh! 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 This one was rough. How does Dota go from last game to this game? Because matchmaking works, man. This is my skill. This is where I'm at. I belong here. All right, can I? Can you deny your ancient? No. <laughs> ah, oh, dude, that needs to be a feature. That. What if it had like 10 health and you accidentally misclicked it? Dude, then that would be so amazing. It, you'd get. You'd get. Less gold given to the other team. It'd be really sick. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Dude, every creep is scary. <laughs> every creep's horrifying. <laughs> what, it's 30 minutes in and they have Megas? Yeah. Yeah, it's not good. Alright, quickly. Sneak it in there. Get it back out. Sneak? Blackhawk oh. down. They got it. Uh-oh. What is happening? The weird part is they actually Roshan. They feel like you guys can still win. That gives me hope. What do you, what, if I if I have used my Silver Edge, or my Knight, if I use the basic Shadow Blade, and, and then, then I turn upgrade it into the a silver, silver Edge, no, yeah. you don't get the Silver Edge hit. All right, Matt Harris is gathered for shrine. Oh fuck, he got a rod of Atos. Oh. Well. Well. It was an emotional roller coaster where at the end we lost twenty-five points total. Oh shit! Can you shit. imagine if you had lost that last game? You would have lost so many points today. No big deal. You would have lost 125 points. Instead, we lost 25 points, man. Feels good. Woo! That was a realistic thing that could have happened today. Yeah, you I know. Have lost 125 points. That's all right. You got you got to wash that rust off at some point. Oh man. Well, dude, I just wanted to say uh, thanks so much for sticking it out and hanging out and coaching me through and teaching me the art of being aggressive as fuck in the mid lane because I I think I actually am. Super excited to go do some mid lane with my Dota people. And Super. not public Dota people. Yeah. I'm, I'm eager to be 3k, maybe forever. I think that that's... We may no, have tapped out, but I think that I think that we can do it. So if I had to if I had to make like a final, you know, wrap it all together comment, oh, yeah. I'd say... I think, I think in, the, in the games at least, you understood the principle. Like... I think in game two you're starting to lose hope in it, but I mean, I, I showed you when I played you when I when I showed Cap, right? It's like yeah. the principle holds true. I hope you realize that like you're gonna have rough games because you're adjusting to it and you're used to playing really far back. But I will tell you that this is the better way to play in the long run, almost every single time. Like it made sense too, right? You were able to make logical assertions about things. Dude, it is so crazy to see how much damage you can do when the creeps are under their tower. Yeah. And if I can just ask one last, or maybe unrelated piece. I don't know if you're done with your spiel, but I'm just going to call my thing the last because I'm, sure. I'm in charge of the mixer. I just turn it off whenever I want. Um, in the safe lane, I like when the support does a pull through and it pulls back to tower and keeps that equilibrium really tight to the tower. Is this because the offlaners generally do not have the proper tools to try to mess with me under tower? Uh, it's it's kind of a mix because oftentimes what you really want to do is 
Well, for one, you you want to utilize the pull as much as you possibly can. If you're pulling under and uh, you're under the tower, it's a little bit awkward because the late. I mean, we yeah, understand sure. now after today what happens, right? When your creeps go under the tower, then you're just gonna push it immediately back, anyways. The better thing to do that I find is like, uh, man, there's so much Dota theory crafting we have to do together at some point. Um, we better, we better get it done. It's like this: you have to accept in Dota that the enemy team will get what they want. Like you can slow it down, but for example, the offlaner, there's only so much you can shut an offlaner down. You know, like he'll get his farmer, he'll get whatever he needs to. So it's more important that you get what you want out of the safe lane. So for example, what me and my friends usually do when we play in comp games and stuff, what we'll do is like, I'll play safe lane or support. Whoever's playing carry will shove out the wave, level one. And then we'll just immediately pull the big camp. And sure, like the the offlaner will get the like half of a wave or something like that, but you know, you'll deny an entire creep wave every single time. Yeah. And you want to enable your supports. Well dude. We're done. We did it. Unless you have anything else you'd like to add? I don't know. Did you even do you feel like you learned something? That that Fuck, wasn't even yeah. supposed to be interesting like yeah, I mean, I think that for me, it's just going to take some time to digest with the mid lane stuff, because I think I've just gotten into like, oh yeah, if it's always pulled towards me, here are the advantages that I get when it's always pulled towards me. And being able to see advantages that happen when you're pushing in are really nice. And also to find out that some of the uh, advantages I thought I had were actually imaginary. Sometime when you have time, I should... I So there's, there's a... There was a major thing that you can improve on that mm. is actually quite simple. It's uh, it's what we talk it's the first video that I sent you regarding how to play the map in Dota. They're like I would say I would actually say your strongest suit in Dota is probably your late game, like your mid to late. You you farm the map quickly and efficiently, but there's something you have to understand. Like Okay, this is like a really high level concept in Dota that was discovered in like the last year, right? So I push out top, you know, I just, I'll shove out top, right? Yeah. And then what would normally happen is I would TP back to base, and then I showed you the good versus bad farm, right? And yeah. I would just go and farm the neutral camp. If you notice in that game, that's what you did every single time as Lena in the 70-minute uh, game. You'd push out a lane aggressively, and then you would look to TP back, and then just go to the nearest camp. That's not what you want to do. Because every single time, like, what I, the, the theme of today is, like, pressuring lanes, like, pushing in waves at all times like this this extends from the early game to the late game so the better play to do like for example you know when they counter pushed it up at top right dota is a game where you shove a wave they shove a wave back so the better thing to do instead of going straight to the jungle because uh i know you don't remember it but i remember it you went to the jungle you farmed two camps and then you immediately had to go there anyways yeah because you feel like you have to constantly farm but if you had made the play mm -hmm. You had pushed out top, you TP back, and then you just immediately started walking top again. You would have had so much more farm in the levels. Oh, the the concept is you push a wave, you leave, and then you go back and repush the same wave. Yeah, because if you understand it, what'll ha what'll end up happening is they'll always go back for that wave. So they'll just push it back into you, because you would do the same, right? If you saw somebody, if you saw somebody push a wave into you, you'd push the wave back, and then you'd feel unsafe, and then you'd come back, right? Yeah. So assume the same the other way around. And huh. then at that point when you reshuffle the wave, then you get access to those two jungle camps. When you played Lena in that in that third game where you won seventy points or whatever, fifty points, the strongest and the best that you felt by far was when you shoved that top wave, you farmed those two creep camps and then you forced everyone over and then you forced them into some weird like five man at the top. That yeah. feels good in Dota. That that creates pressure. That's doing something on the map. Hitting neutrals isn't inherently bad. But if you're just hitting neutrals for the sake of hitting neutrals and not shoving waves back, then you're going to feel like crap. Well, awesome. I I have, like, so fucking much to digest. <laughs> also, here's my other cat. I mean, I, I like, there's a huge cat here, and I'm trying to, like, connect to what you're saying. But I also have a huge cat here. This is Despy. Yeah, All right. Despy, let's. Brother. 
Yeah, this is this is Desperado. All right, let's let's see if we can get the cat to meow. Dispy, meow. Now I just look like an idiot, but I'm I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this. Okay, she likes mugs, so I gotta take it away from her. Dispy, meow. Come on, come on, just once on this show. Dispy. Yes, oh. fuck yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Despy, one more time. Let's do it. There's your mug. You're staying right. greedy now. Yeah, look, this cat just, she loves mugs. She just loves to rub against them and to look at them. And, okay, look, I'm getting distracted. I'm going to move the cat. Ugh. Um. Yeah, well, I'm just going to wrap it up. Uh, let me just say, dude, thank you so much again for teaching me all about the mid-pressurage and about the mid- and late-game lane pressurage. I think the big takeaways uh, for me are, of course, like all the, the early-game stuff, but also a lot of the things about just stay topped off and just go back, and it's okay to go back. And if you're getting pressured, change your expectations. Don't just try to non-stop use the same benchmarks every single game. Um, and then also the I mean, mid -lane It's all relative, pushing. right? Like when you felt like you were behind, as a result of the game, everyone was behind it's different. They were trilating you mid. It happens. Well, fuck yeah, man. I now look forward to being able to gobble up all the goddamn ladder points in mid. Mm. Now, I have to ask you again. What's up? Where can people find you? They can't. Dude, it's it's twitter.com slash bliss it says, it says underscore the Dota. Kevin Godick. This is Purge Gamers here. Yeah, go to Purge Gamers, message at, at Purge, Purge Gamers, Gamers, and say, who are you when you're Asian? And then the, then Kevin, it'll be his job to convey to everyone where to find you. It's going to be great. I hope you can stick it. All right, bye. Peace. <laughs> Best outro, I know.